Bioshock Infinite is a game rated M by the ESRB. Hello everyone and welcome back to more Steven Plays Bioshock Infinite Burial at Sea. On the last episode, we are slowly but surely making our way through... Uh, I mean, <laughs> we have to go to the Silverfin restaurant. But also, we gotta find all four of these, uh... Coded transmissions. Atlas has been sending coded transmissions uh, to and from his people. I'm actually gonna make this my current objective. I'm kind of curious where that would take me, and apparently nowhere. Uh, the other thing that was really interesting that happened last time is that we now have the ability to use um, see through walls uh, forever, which is wild and also wonderful. I love it so much. We don't have infinite locks, but. We're going to go ahead and use these. Uh Okay, don't get the don't get the sound noisemaker, but It looks like how far does that go? Does that go all the way over here? It does not. Okay. Uh and big and there's also a vent here which could be very useful. Let's start with this, shall we? Of course, the buildings are being fabricated above the waves. But we will lower them on a lunette ring, submerged into the structure's steel frames. So much steel, you wonder. How will we keep so large a purchase from the government? Water is buoyant. We shall not frame rapture in steel, but in aluminium. The government jackals may suspect me of building an air force, but never a city. Oh, Andrew Ryan, you sly dog. I also love how this is, um, you know, making... Like, you know, there, there's, a, there's a lot to be learned, basically, from... You know, a, a, all of the extra lore and stuff that we get a chance to see. And that's exciting. So I want to get in there, obviously. I guess I can always look for, in, you know, infinitely. Um, I know that these now require, like, lockpicks to deal with, and I don't have enough lockpicks to deal with that. So I'm either going to have to run in there, or I'm going to have to use this vent. So I'm, gonna, I'm just going to vote the vent. Vent seems preferable to me. And we'll hope that vent makes the most sense. Oh, God. I lost half of my health immediately. I mean... Give me the cold shoulder. Dang. Dang. <laughs> that was extreme. That was extreme. I'm glad that I can see things, you know, infinitely. But, uh, that's not good. Alright, let's... There's a guy up there that suspects, but <coughs> doesn't see me. Okay. And there's something here, but it's probably not terribly worthwhile. I saw where you went. Okay, it went by. Gross, man. Absolutely disgusting. Break's over. Alright. There's a few things here. You're against a guy making an honest buck. I Let's see, where was is... For There's a guy up there. I can just keep turning this on. Will that guy see me? What if I used this... It might chew them anyway. I'm hoping that that thing will shoot him. This is working pretty well so far. It has to actually kill him. Come on, buddy. You're really making this difficult. Give me just the normal one. 
Some wasting crap. I know right where you are. You definitely don't. Otherwise, you would have dealt with me already. Okay, this is actually. This is not working out as well as I wanted it to. I really need to kill him because if I jump down here in the water, all that's going to happen is he's going to come see me. So I'm trying to figure out how to. Okay. And this is all covered in water. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's do it, and then just... See, is there anything below here? We're going to have to take the top path first, honestly. We're going to have to see what's up here. And there's nothing behind me or anything, right? I don't think so. They're above us. Alright. Sounded awful irregular. I saw where you went. Not giving me a lot of time. I ain't through with you yet. Very worried about this. I won't roll over for you. Performing a melee attack on an alert enemy will only stun him. Evade your foe until he loses track of you. Oh god. That only seems to be knocking them back. You're only gonna do real damage that way if they don't see you coming. Okay, I can also just shoot him. Perfectly acceptable. Come on out, you. Or that'll work. I still haven't uh, fired a shot, I, I think. I'm pretty sure I have not yet fired a gun. Which is the weirdest thing. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. Alright, there's something good in here. Uh, it requires five. Okay. Cool. Uh, Eve. This is fine. This is fine. Is there anything else up here? Alright. Man, one thing about it is that if I am... Oh, there's two. <laughs> if I am supposed to, um... You know, grab some of the other stuff before I get here, at least I will have figured out this place pretty well. So there's a vending machine. Uh, I could also just go ahead and buy some. But again, if it's for a plasmid I don't have yet, it's not going to let me utilize it. But I also haven't been spending my money. So maybe I'm okay. Very dangerous. I went for it, and I don't know if that was smart or stupid. And to be honest, it doesn't really matter because now it's done. So let's go for it. Let's go ahead and unlock this thing. Maybe I can get a noisemaker in the process. Yes, I can. Got it. Woo! Freaking out just a little bit. Possess turret mod. Adds ability to possess turrets forever. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I'm so glad that I bought that. Turrets will be my friends forever? I mean, of course it costs Eve, but now I can get back through that area with no problems at all. Oh, I am slowly re... I'd say regaining skills, but I guess not regaining skills so much as just gaining skills. Hold to pick up radar range. Got a new gun. Hold left mouse to fire a microwave energy beam. Keep the beam focused on an enemy to make him explode and damage anyone nearby, which we saw in the first DLC. And that's even more Eve. But before I use that, I should actually... Um, before I use that, I should actually possess this stuff, and then I can refill all of my junk. Seems like a good plan. So wait for it. Wait for it to go back. 
that's possessed permanently. Make our way down here very carefully. Possessed permanently. Possessed permanently. And now I have no stuff. Although it will still let me use this even if I have actively, like, no Eve, which is wonderful. It should work like that, so I'm glad it does. And now I can run all the way back over here. Grab this. Nice! Nice! And now I can plunder the crap out of everything. I thought that this was something I was supposed to interact with, but I guess not. Um, and this is, again, some something that I'll probably have to come back to, but I'm going to be able to get through other areas a little bit, eas uh, a little bit more easily because I've already got some of these mods. So, um, yeah, I don't, I don't feel bad about this at all. Is there anything I can use here? Because these things work for me. And if I see another turret, it's going to make my life easier, not harder. I kind of wonder if it would take down a Big Daddy, but that might be a fool's errand. I don't know. Another med kit. Up to four now. Haven't had to buy any. And again, more importantly, haven't died. All right, so... Let's see what we got in here. Examine note. Another coded message. Okay, that's two of four, Attempt right? Attempt to retrieve Ace in the hole from Su Chong unsuccessful. Ryan Private Security killed three of our men in the bargain. We'll need to explore alternate means of obtaining Ace. That's two of four. So I'm still I'm still looking for him. It's optional, which means I should do it. I'm hoping. Uh, so I got to get my health back up, and then I'm also hoping I can get some money <laughs> or lockpicks. Or both, because I really went all in trying to get into these places. But this looks good. This all looks good. And, yeah, this is not going to help me navigate to an objective. Because they, they won't highlight that particular kind of objective. And I think... Yeah, they're not gonna, they're not going to cause more folks to show up. So I'm done in this area, too. Convenient. Still learning to uh, to land silently. Just making sure I'm good back here. I am. I believe I am. But you can never be too careful. All right, back into the elevator. Oh God, man, man, it's been a whole thing. It's been a whole thing. There's no one around here, right? And that's... Sorry, now I'm, like, slightly lost. Okay, now, I, now I'm starting to remember where I was. All right. Okay, and this brings me out... Look around so I can figure out my bearings. I don't see the big daddy. There's a splicer, okay, but like, where? I don't see them. Where are they? I think I'm too far away. All right, so uh, first things first. The, the good news... Oh, there he is. Okay. Should really try and get into a vent. But that'll be safe. Because I can see him forever. Um, let's... We need to finally, I think, go to the restaurant. I think that is probably the best route. Did I check this vent already? It's one of the problems is that there's been so much stuff. So I'm just gonna crawl in here quick to see if this looks familiar. Is this where I found both of those guys? Yeah, okay. That's okay, this is actually kind of a shortcut for where I need to go. I just need to 
if I'm if there's nowhere else to find here, then I can probably just make this the current objective. And there's splicers just chilling together over there. And I've been through all of this. Let's see, silver fish. God. Distract multiple enemies. And I'm like, but what if I just figured this out? Wants me to go that way. Really? Are you sure? Because that's not really the way I want to go. Everything's fine. There's a few folks over there. Sure, I hear you. That's Clear not good. It's not good. Uh, let's do a four of these. God, the frickin' water. I swear. God. <laughs> God, he's mad. He's so mad. They're like looking in the vent. Gross. Alright, so I finally made my way up to the silver fin, and I'm actually going to go in it this time. The silver fin. This used to be a restaurant when I first came through. Now it belongs to the Suchong. Looks like I'm not the first one who tried to get in here. Well, at least he left a trail. Choose my lucky number. All right, so I got to find another way in. But again, not terribly concerned because I've been getting all of the mods to make my life easier. Uh, okay, so I haven't been this way. Blueprint. Somebody must have shot him when he tried to break into Su Chong's. Huh. What's this? Hmm. Well, seems like central heating came from this room, so it would stand to reason that the ductwork should go to Su Chong's. Wait a minute. First off. Check this area. I can't check you. My Eve is already full. Just making sure I'm not getting myself screwed here. There's actually an enemy fairly close, but as long as I'm not making a ton of noise in here, I'll probably be fine. Hopefully, this doesn't count as making noise. Su Chong wasn't exactly a master of subterfuge. Alright, let's see what we have in this vent. Again, these can work for me forever now. Which is wonderful. I honestly didn't expect that, like that that would be one of the possession things, but that's so great. It's so freaking great. Um, there's going to be another one coming up. But... So far, so good. And that one's my friend. And there's one up here that's not. Disarm the device. <laughs> Why would I ever do that? Then it wouldn't work for me. I mean, I guess if, if at some point I didn't have Eve, then it could be problematic, but... On its own? No. This is my buddy. This is my friggin' friend. I'm actually glad I didn't come this way first, because I would have wasted lockpicks on that stuff. So this actually worked out better, I think. Still a lot of enemies around. I think we found our man. No sign of him now. Either he's dead, or working for Ryan. What's the difference? Enemies, 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 enemies. But I think I'm actually safe in here. I think this is okay. Fire a noise maker. Now I'm good. 
There's probably enemies up here somewhere, but I don't see them. Silver Finn. Columbia. He knew about Columbia. And and Booker and and me. The Sutro must have found a way to reopen the tear I made to come here. But how? That's creepy. Very creepy. Shotgun ammo full, because I haven't used it. Man, they've they've really wanted us to come here for a while. And I just kept going, eh, you know, soon. A Lutest device. That's how he must have reopened the tear. Okay, examine the Lutest device. There's lockpicks and stuff in here. Okay. I'm always worried that I'm gonna get stuck, right? Like, I'm gonna be looking for stuff and feel like I've done a good job, and all of a sudden they're gonna rip me from the area and be like, oh, well, now you can't continue. So that looks like. Is that Columbia in there? It might be. Look, the tear still leads back to Columbia. Plasmids, Vigors. He and Fink must have been in communication, sharing secrets. Like the Lutesses before they were physically together. Why did I need to come here? What does this have to do with Sally? You remember, don't you? It hasn't happened yet? I told you, I can't do that. Concentrate, Elizabeth. No, the doors are shut. They're... Lutest particle. I use the Lutest particle. If, if it can make a city float... It can make a prison rise. I can't open tears, but we could use this device to go to Columbia and find a particle. But it's been vandalized. You'll fix it. Sure. You know, my tower didn't come stock with the Lutest device repair manual. You will fix it. Yeah, I'll just... Elizabeth, you will fix it. Okay. Okay, there must be some information around here. All right. So that's our next true goal, and I have a feeling that when we go through to Columbia, that we'll probably not be coming back. So the cool stuff that I have found that I haven't been able to yet get a hold of, um, I need to make sure that I, you know, get it. That's my guess. I mean, I haven't played this, but that's that's my guess, is because in the main game, when we jumped through portals, we had a tendency to not return. Sometimes they told us, and sometimes they did not. There's stuff in here, but none of the things that are in here are enemies, so let's just look around. See what we can find. Searching around seems helpful uh, as we continue to increase our health back to full. Feeling good! As a, uh, a wise philosopher once said as he was roaming around at the speed of sound. Ooh, audio diary. And before I knew it, Ryan had me bounced out of my own restaurant. And that Korean had the run of the place. <laughs> it was a good business, I tell you. I never should have told anyone about that light. About those weird buildings I saw floating in the clouds. And most of all, I never should have told no one about that girl who showed up one day in that old timey blue dress. Seems like Morris's only crime was being too honest. So this is probably how we get through there. That'd be my guess. These are elements. Sodium, titanium. Why would these be on schematics for... It's code. A visionaire cipher. If if we assume hydrogen is A, and iron the 26th element is C... You always used to need a code key. Or... It's right here. Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. Looks like a punch list for things Su Chong needs to fix the machine. Cold cathode tube, a carbon dioxide scrubber, and a heat sink. Any of the vending machines should have the cathode tube. And we can look for a CO2 scrubber in the bathosphere showroom. A lot of models should have them. A heat sink. Oh, that's. We're in a department store. Are we gonna find. Keep your coal with Old Man Winter. That'll work. Time to find those parts. 
And then I just have to repair the most sophisticated piece of technology ever created. Elizabeth, you saw yourself make this repair. You can do this. Whatever you say. Guess we better find our way out of here. So, the downside is that... Atlas, you there? I need a favor. A favor? I don't suppose you've conjured up the miracle you promised yet? I'm working on it. I'm gonna need some old man winter. You might try where they hawk them new bathospheres. As I hear it, old man winter's the only thing keeps their batteries from bursting into flames after five minutes. Thanks. Think nothing of it. But it's the last favor you'll be getting. Huh. So, as I kind of suspected, I was a little worried about, but pushed forward anyway. Um, they really wanted you to come here first, because there's going to be things we need to collect in the other places. The good news is, Dan is editing this, and can just cut things out, and it's not a problem. So if we have to return to a place, you guys won't have to watch me do it twice. Uh, alright. Audio diary time. Problem. Big Daddy will not imprint on the little brats. Yet Fink succeeded in imprinting his disgusting bird on his subject. How has Fink, this stupid man, succeeded where Su Chang failed? If Su Chang could obtain hair sample of Fink's subject, Su Chang could determine delta of genetic material with little sister. Proof is in DNA pudding. So much information about Columbia is in here. It's interesting to see the worlds intertwined. Okay, uh... I need to go this direction. I'm not very scared of things anymore because I can use infinite sight. Which is terribly helpful. I need a third lockpick. And I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to get one, but I definitely want to scour all of these places. So I really need to find another lockpick. Okay. Let's see. This goes back down. Can I get out from this way now? I would assume. Probably. Penalty for vandalism of Su Chang device is a death. Even for pretty ladies. I suppose you'd be Su Chong. Save your ammunition, your device doesn't work. Device will work? Vandal sabotage! You are Vandal! Actually, I intend to fix your device. That is, unless you plan on coming down here and doing it yourself. It's not prudent for Su Chong to return to lab. And you say you can fix I broke your code, didn't I? Now just give me the one to open that door and we'll see what your creation can do. One, two, one, six. Your birthday? Enough with dog. Fix the machine. 216. How'd you know that? Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. <laughs> Sorry, what was it? I've literally already forgotten. 1216. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and before I do this, see how close trouble is. A lot of enemies around. Which I could probably do without. I also don't have uh, the right thing equipped. This is probably what I want. Unless I just want to start killing folks, which haven't really done yet, but I could. So, yes, sir. That's correct, sir. I'm representing Olympus Heights. Let's be very careful. Hope I do you all proud, gang. All right, so uh, find. So these are all the things we have to find. Among them, we still are working towards this. We have uh, two of the four. Uh, Old Man Winter is arguably most pressing. But also, if we could come to think of it, if we got a... I'm assuming I can just go back in here now. Yeah. If I bought a single lockpick, just one stupid lockpick, I could go grab that whatever the special thing is. I'm just not sure where a vending machine is. 
Okay, that's my that's my current plan. I'm gonna find I'm gonna find a vending machine and buy a lockpick and go deal with whatever is in there. There, that machine. It'll have the cathode too. Oh yeah, but it'll also have a lockpick. Okay, um, I guess I'll grab this while I'm here. Scavenge cathode tube. Got it. Now we need to find old man Winter in a CO2 scrubber. Okay, I also need to buy a lockpick. And I have no money again. But now I can make my way back to where I was to uh, figure out what was in there. Well, I certainly wish I could have just found one, but the fact that I can afford it is good. So let's find out what's behind this stupid door, shall we? Let's wait for the far end. Far end. I'll take white, that's fine. Survey says... Another that requires Old Man Winter. Okay. That's fine. Our goal then, next episode, is to get Old Man Winter. Because once we get it, we will be able to grab the two power-ups for Old Man Winter. And that seems like a pretty good deal. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time for more Stephen Plays. Bioshock Infinite. Burial at Sea.